Ngayon lang, kailangan po natin mag-sustain ito para ho sa atin. Hindi yun lang sa Pilipino. Para sa atin. Para sa atin. Kanina sabi sa akin, uh, how do you call this? Uh, the introduction was, uh, was said that uh, the one in charge, the reason I have all these four terminal managers is they will be the one in charge. They will make sure that this campaign will be sustained. This, sustain, this campaign can be consistently be implemented. Hindi lang po ako, sila, kayo, ang katulong namin para sa itong initiative. Allow me to uh, read my personal message to everyone. It may be a small thing, but it becomes so common, becomes so commonplace that we don't think about it too much. But this begs the question of whether there's still civility in our workplace. Our roads, our public spaces, and most important to us here at Naia, our airport. It is hard to understand why people sometimes behave the way they do throughout all the of this. Stress from many different places causes all of those to reach a certain level of frustrations and shortness of temper. You know, when we experience, when we travel, Marami ko tayong iniisip. We are all excited when we plan our trips, when we plan our travel. However, when we get to the airport, there are so many things that we have to contend with. Iisipin natin, are we going to reach the airport on time? Do we have a booking? Is our booking confirmed? Makikita ko ho ba yung bagahe ko pagdating sa destination? May makikita ba sa loob ng bagahe ko na hindi ko po pwede? Many things that really uh, makes us at some uh, sometimes frustrates and even compounded by undisciplined people. The reason why we're having this is for us to be able to lessen the stress of our airport travelers. Lalo na dito. From, from January to June this year, if I may just share some statistics, we had about 60,000 international flights and 76,000 domestic flights that went through in and out of the airport. That's about roughly 12.7 million. Um, you can just imagine the stress of it all for both passengers and staff. Emotions are running high. Everyone wants to get to where they are going, as what I've said earlier. Um, that's why sometimes when people are reminded by the authorities to follow rules at the airport, they feel oppressed. And then there are others, other cases when people feel that they can do anything they want. Cut lines put up their feet on the chairs. Siguro naman, nakikita natin lahat ito. Put their backs on the chair which is supposed to be occupied by other travelers. Ito common. Leave their trust anywhere they feel to do it. Perhaps even without knowing them, knowing it, this sense of entitlement, I'm making, put, I'm, I'm, I'm making emphasis on entitlement. We feel always entitled. That sometimes is our problem. And uh, it makes us uncivilized or even undisciplined. That's why this, this is the naia is coming up. This misuse of privilege position is more commonplace that you think. It is for this very reason that we are launching the Sibina Ia. A civility campaign that aims to encourage airport users to bring back the good old days, the good old good manners and right conduct, simply as 
GNRC. Kulang na po tayo ng Good Mothers and Right Conrad. The initiative is being launched so that Filipinos are able to return to the positive values that make Filipinos, Filipinos capable of observing rules and proper conduct, encouraging others to do the same. We're going back to basic. That's basically it. Ang disiplina talaga kailangan po natin. Basic in a sense na gawin ang tama. Not because somebody's watching, not somebody, not, not because there's penalty, because that, that, that is the right thing to do. I'm putting emphasis on that. Because yun ang tama natin gagawin. Hindi lang po may nagbabantay, may nakatingin, sisitahin kayo, papapahiya tayo, but it is ultimately the right thing to do. Posters will be shown as what you've seen, but this is just an initial stage that we are going to do. There is a continuing launch and all the terminals will be equipped with all these reminders. I call them reminders so that every Filipino traveler or every Filipino airport citizen will be aware that there is some sense of civility and discipline in this particular airport. We might not be competing in terms of infrastructures as the, compared to the rest of the airports within the Asian region. But the Filipino heart of being hospitable and with good manners and right conduct will stand out at the end of the day. So I encourage everybody, my team, all the stakeholders, immigration, customs, police, everybody that is populating this airport to please do your part. Magandang kumago po sa inyo lahat.